A common sound in kitchens around the world. Hot, sizzling cooking oil. Throughout the year, the average human consumes around 20 kilograms of vegetable oil. In Egypt, that number is even higher. And once used, most of it's discarded, but not always. I have this waste produced. Now I have to figure out what to do with this oil. Back in 2013, Nour Asal created Tagadot, a Cairo-based startup that recycles used cooking oil to produce biofuel, a low-carbon alternative source of energy. This year, Nour decided to look into more ways of simplifying the collection at home. We are enabling waste collection through technology, through creating an Uber-like platform that connects collectors with households. When the frying is done, it takes a few clicks on the app to get a collector to come and pick up the used oil. The customer also gets something in return, such as bottles of new cooking oil ready for their next meal, making the system more profitable and eco-friendly as well. So we process thousands of requests on a daily basis, um, and these are mainly happening across um, different parts of Egypt. Uh, so we think that there's a huge impact that is done on the environmental level. Biofuels can be used as an alternative to petrol in cars and other transportation. With over 10 million vehicles on the road in Egypt, an efficient waste oil collection could lead to a greater adoption of biofuels. I think biofuels can be used here in Egypt in the very near future, um, mainly to reduce the, the greenhouse gas emissions and to be able to be part of uh, the climate change movement. For now, Noor plans to expand his business across the Middle East and North Africa with the hope that less people will pour his idea of a greener future down the drain. Anna Stewart, CNN.